3, 2, 1. Hi guys, I'm Medina. Hi guys, and I'm Kelvin. And together you are watching MNK show. show. Guys, just sit back, relax and enjoy because this one is going to be a bumpy but exciting ride. Yeah, it's our first episode and we were a bit nervous about it, but we hope you like it. Today our topic is going to be pros and cons of moving to Istanbul and just living in Turkey in general. It's going to be like from our personal experience. So, enjoy! Who else can explain what, what they've been experiencing more than us? Who came from another part of the world to hear Istanbul? It's nice though. Exactly. <laughs> so, we're going to start. How many years are you in here? How many years are we here? Because we, we came the same time, do you, do you remember that? Yeah, of course. We actually were in the same class. Yeah, only a for a week. School. Only for yeah, a week. Yeah, only for a week. And you had to run away from our class. Yeah, I ran away from their class. But actually, at first, for, for me, it's, it was something. It was actually a nerve-wracking experience. Imagine, you come here and you don't even know a, a Turkish word. The yeah. first Turkish word that I knew was... Seviorum. Not, Are you not serious? Trust me. That, Why? That, I don't know. Is that, that, that's the only word that I knew. I don't even know how I learned that word. I'll tell you about what happened in the airport. Like, no, you actually didn't. You know, I wanted to declare my passport. But who does not <gasps> speak any international language? That's for working with foreigners. Why the hell you don't know any other language? Burasi Turkey. Yeah. That's being rude. That's because Luin Chikar. I don't even know what he's saying now. Are you crazy? <laughs> like, maybe this guy did not even understand. Time out? Okay, great. So, right now we're gonna list pros and cons of living in here. I think everybody would be pretty curious about what we think as foreigners. So, we're gonna start with pros. And my first one is experience, obviously, because. You're moving to a new country, it's always a great experience. And the second one is moving at 17. I was really young. I mean, I just finished school mm -hmm. and I came here and that's all. Of my research and stuff, I knew that Turkey was a bit of um, like too much into tourism. And I knew about the Hagia Sophia, so I was like, I really want to see the Hagia Sophia. Uh, the Turkish food is just awesome. I love eating. It's just that unfortunately I cannot gain weight, but I love eating. Third one of my pros is the uh, like holiday period. The way they unite, like for example for Ramadan, mm -hmm. they all unite, they all sit together, they're really generous at this time and it's just beautiful. When I come here, I will see snow. So oh I was so happy the first day that I saw snow. Unfortunately, I got sick. Oh. So, the other one, cats. Cats are everywhere. I'm, I'm a cat lady. Hi. Uh, people love cats in here. I don't love cats. How can you not love cats? They're furry, they're cute, and they have attitude. Better than people. Uh, I think my soulmate is gonna be a cat. Creepy! Another pro that I got is just that um, I love languages. You can even teach me Russian. How do you say hi in Russian? Привет. Oh, that's too much. Guys, you know what? Uh, I find Russian a bit scary sometimes. It's like rude as hell. You can say F you mm. in so many ways. Other one, strangers always want to help you. Mm. People are really helpful. Even if you're not asking anyone to help you, they're still gonna yeah. come up to you and say, what's wrong? Do you need help? True. Why are you Turks. crying? <laughs> Guys, you're so hospitable, trust me. And unfortunately, that's all <laughs> about the pros. Let's go <laughs> to the cons. First one. I'm not sure if people are gonna like that one. Mm. I mean, they're not gonna like to hear that, but it's true. In here, people can smile at your face and say a lot of things behind your back. I know that one. I really I, know that and one. And here it's like, hi, I love you so much. And they're like, oh my God, I hate that person. You do know about charming racism. Somebody just comes and they shower you with unnecessary love. They'll be like, you, you're so cute. The second one, humor. People, I don't get your humor. You see your comedy movies? Do you actually laugh at them? Um, in Azirle Koku, we actually had, uh, you know, our teacher could come with the movie. Trust me, I was like, and the guys were laughing. Even my teacher was laughing. Why is she laughing? And trust me, Jamie Umaz, now I like him. I like him, but at first I was like, uh, what's that? Third one, 
You people are drama queens. All of you. It doesn't matter <laughs> if you're, you're a, a guy. Man or a girl. Yeah, it doesn't matter if you're a girl or a guy. You're a drama queen. You're gonna whine about the smallest thing ever. Oh my god, how can you say oh, that? Okay. Don't touch me, people. I'm gonna. The, the Turks, uh, guys, I love you. Don't get me wrong. I really love you guys, but <laughs> sometimes Turks, you are so short tempered and it's unnecessary. I, I'm really afraid of you sometimes, guys, but I love you. <laughs> now let me, let me give you another one, which is a bit funny. There's a traffic, right? Yeah. Then there's a guy who was like at the back and he started to hoot his car like so loud. Like you guys get out of the way. Now, dude, you are the one who is late. You people should not have driver lessons. Next one. Mm. A marriage priority. I'm talking about the females. Why is your priority in life is to get married? Not even fall in love, find love and blah, 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 have kids. It's just to get married, this one day. Your music, your music, your music is depressing, guys. Your music is so depressing. It seems as if you want to cry in each and every song. Zimbabweans love music, but dancing music, we love dancing to music. Yeah, then this other lady, she was like, I hate opera, guys. I hate opera. Really hoping that no one is gonna hate us. <laughs> we just meet you next time. But trust me, you will love this. Well, I'm not sure, but I hope you do. <laughs> we are signing out. Okay, bye. <laughs>